Hello guys and welcome to Indie Ninja Gaming. I am the Indie Ninja. Yeah. And today we are gaming with a weird, weird little kind of storyline puzzle game, Maze. So, I've played this before but it's a bit weird. I'm not going to lie. Um, but it's a long time ago, so it's a puzzle based so if I remember rightly. So I'm not going to remember how to do everything. Um... But the way I remember it is it's a bit like uh, a <laughs> Stanley Parable meets large talking plant creatures and no voiceover. Okay, I did cut some of that out. It was a, one hell of a loading screen there. Took a while. I thought there was no audio for a moment then. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, my FPS, it feels a little laggy. Shouldn't do. Right, I've just dropped the visual down one notch. Little difference, but not a huge amount. Oh, what is with this? Why am... Oh, God, I remember the... Uh... Oh, God, I remember this now. Oh, it doesn't appear to be a motion blur. That's good. I hate motion blur so much. Oh, okay. good. I feel like something's going to jump out at me. I cannot remember for the life of me everything. Like, like. I remember then I thought that was another direction. I remember the, the, obviously a corn maze, but. What's. Silo in the background there. What's this? The hell? I don't remember that. <laughs> Um, okay. House in this direction. I know I can interact with that door. I'm just checking out. Can't go through there. Can't get it. Okay, so we've got to go through the house. Oh, that door, whatever it was. Uh, this way. Two sex guys. Hopefully that'll be a little smoother. And hopefully, I can't tell now. Well, I've basically I've just disabled the preview on uh, on the on OBS. Okay. So what? Am I meant to find some stuffs? I mean, like I said, it's a puzzle thing. I just can't remember the order of things and, and what's what. And See, this is all blocked off. We know this. Or not. Okay. <laughs> now I'm just doubting everything. Um, where am I? Where am I going? I get lost so easily in certain things. Pressing Q does absolutely nothing. They're right. It does absolutely squat all. <laughs> I've got a very sensitive mouse, by the way. <laughs> so just up if something makes me jump I'm gonna be like ah. oh, that's minimal movement that was like 
Right, so if I were to do that, that's probably, yeah, about less than a centimeter in movement. Oh, okay. This has like an Alice in Wonderland feel about it. Uh, a welcome note. A note lazily scribbled including a stock greeting and encourages the reader to enjoy the complimentary snack on the desk. Notes to the reader. Mind the boxes and also says open the big door and we'll probably say hello. Okay. Oh, those boxes opened when I picked up the snack. Okay, so I've got two item slots. Can't open those drawers. Hard as <laughs> English muffin. Hard as granite. This muffin is most definitely nowhere near fit for consumption. Despite how much you try, all you've done is giving yourself a headache. <laughs> oh. I have to cook things like that at work in the mornings. It gets very tedious cooking it on mass like that. This way to a windmill. That's bright. Jeez. Okay, so I can't get through there. What we've got down here, press space bar to look at the story items in your Yeah, done that already. Oh, go barn house. I think that's that big door we try to open. One thing at a time. <laughs> we'll go see the spooky statue in a minute. Uh, no, I'm not going to go down there yet. I am so expecting to get someone to make me jump. I can't go down that way. When you see the player, that's probably a key or something then. I didn't realise that went all the way around like that. Now I was a key and I was left in this general area. It'd be near the plant pots. Well that's a <laughs> teleport crouch. Lovely. Not what we are not what we're used to right now. Okay, well I'm not seeing a key. We'll go down in here. Some rubbish. Yeah. That's on a chain. Do I need to do anything with that? I don't know why it's in the chicken coop. Well, I mean, it might have been, uh, they might have been using the guard chickens to, to keep an eye on things. And the guard chickens are notoriously vicious, so. Come on. I don't think I've got a light. Uh, wait, wait, wait. I never actually clicked on that one. That's fine. Oh, mouse moving on. That might help. No. I'm 
mean, it would help a lot, but. And I can't see anything other than this. Uh, an invoice for a commissioned wooden statue. Cost is in the hundreds of thousands. <laughs> Items on the line include chopping down a large old oak tree, carved statue out of oak, uh, out of oak tree, and hospital bills for injuries sustained chopping down the oak tree. <laughs> Get out of the dark room. Why can't you turn on the lights? What have we got here? Looks like a spaghetti maker. Sausage grinder. Something is jammed inside. Oh, okay. So you can switch between like that. Oh, oh, put oil in here. No? Ah. Oh. I would have thought it might, might have made whatever was inside slippery enough to come out, to fall out. Oh. Can I break this super hard muffin? Kind of obvious. Hey, poured rat to corn oil in sink. The smell was worse than imagined. What's that? Nail, cl <laughs> nail clippers. Okay. Highly doubt, but. Oh, hello. Unlock secret door, making it much less secret. Haven't even gone upstairs yet. Fuse box, missing a fuse. I don't know why I tried putting the muffin in there. The, the nail clippers, at least, I thought, you know, all making a connection. And that leads to the outside. If I open this up, do I get some light? I pressed the wrong thing. There we go. Not, not much. But we now have an, an alternative way in and out. Oh, so maybe if I can fix that, I can get some lights in here. What the hell? That's just... no. No! I don't even want to go there. Oh. Nice. I'm used to a space bar being jumped. There's no jump in this. Right. So... Uh, upstairs. Or, we've still got this room here. Now, well, there is something over there. Really boring mystery novel. Okay. So let's take a look at what we... Oh, it's here. Having no talent at the genre, the author mistakenly revealed the murderer's identity on the first page <laughs> and spent the rest of the novel outlining a story about the detective bullying a pair of pants. What the hell? What? Oh my god, this is just... Vigilant as you are when it comes to personal hygiene, the only two things these clippers will do for you are grip something lodged in a wall and give you a 100% tetanus guarantee. That's it. <laughs> uh, fruit crate. 
Despite what the name would suggest, the crate was specifically used to hold a large number of pine cones in order to start a collection. The collection currently sits at zero. This, what the what the hell were they on when they when they came up with this game? <laughs> That's what I want to know. Oh, okay, this goes here for some weird 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 reason. Again, I go to jump. It just showed me the outline of the box, you know. It's just wobbly wardrobe. Do you know what? I think I might have to stick a bit of wood there or something. Use it as a lever. So, oh my, stop trying to jump. I really need to stop trying to jump. All right, well, let's go look at this. Uh, oh, no, we've got in here as well. Yeah. Oh, what's that? Oh, sh A bobby pin. Maybe that will work as a fuse. Extremely useful for picking a lock, but you mistakenly thought it was a pencil and wrote a very detailed account of your day up to that point and didn't notice there was no ink until a few hours ago. Okay. So, no, I can't use this as a fuse then if it's going to be a, a lock pick. I mean, that is the go to for a, bobby pin, for a bobby pin in a game, but given as weird as this is, I figured. Yeah, they might have an alternate use for it. Right, so that's still blocked off. Let's go check out that weird, weird, weird statue. Ah! Thank you, weird, weird wooden statue that cost somebody their life. Or almost cost somebody their life. I'm thinking this might be that lever if I'm right about what it is. Hey! Just want to state that is not memory. That is just that was just an obvious thing to me. You know, put the box. Why else would you put a box in front of a wardrobe? There's two options. One, you either open the wardrobe and let the thing spit out into it, or two. It was a wobbly wardrobe, so you know. Got to push it. I don't know why we couldn't just shove it. But... Oh, I need to. I need to help my fires. I need to. I need to work out my fires. Can I have that? Can... What's this? Burnt lab report. It was burnt because it was in a toaster. <laughs> Much of it you can't read, but the words "abject failure" appear several times. So does hurt feelings, sentient corn stalks, and why did we do this? Uh, where am I going? Oh, what's this? What's this? Eh. No idea what that is. And a mallet. Anything we need to know? Smash something perfectly flat with this trusty tool, but remember, you can never unflatten things with this. It is the mallet's greatest weakness. I wonder if Thor ever thought about that. You can't unsmash something. Oh, stop trying to jump. I really, really, really need to get on top of that. Otherwise, all you're going to have for an entire episode is don't jump. Stop. Why are you jumping? Why? Stop. Don't. No. That's all you're going to get. You need to remember, that cannot jump. Even that will bind that key. Okay, so we went all the way up there for that. I wonder if this can be used on the uh, sausage grinder. No. There's nothing else in here. 
and just on the off chance, not expecting it to work now. No. All right, guys, well, that appears to be the end of the first episode. I just looked over at my timer. I would like to thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoy this game. It is a bit of a weird one. Um, and it's going to take me a moment to get back into the stride of, of you know, just talking to no one, but talking to everyone. So <laughs> it will take me a moment, guys, a couple of episodes, but I'll get back into it. Why do you keep telling me about... I'm going to leave it here. Otherwise, I'm going to keep going. And yeah, so anyway, guys, Please don't forget, if you like my content, just hit that thumbs up for me. Uh, it helps out. If you want to see, if you want to get notified, obviously click the little bell icon um, once you've subbed and all that good stuff. So I want to thank you all very much for watching and hopefully I'll see you next time. Thanks, guys. Goodbye. <laughs>